guess what? I got my BoxyCharm Premium for the month of December. If you are new here, my name is Kyla. And if you do not know what the BoxyCharm Premium box is, well, it is a beauty subscription box that you pay $35 a month and can receive from six to seven full-size products. That could be makeup or skin care. So in order to get this BoxyCharm Premium box, you do need to be a regular BoxyCharm member, which means you need to pay the regular price of $25 a month until you get off the wait list for this box. Yes, you heard me correctly. There is a wait list. So if you want to sign up with the premium box, you will be sent to the wait list or be signed up on the wait list until you are able to receive the box for the upcoming month. All right, so let's go ahead and get this bad boy open. And I'm done. Look at this nice inner side of the box. Oh yeah. You do receive a pamphlet with the products you receive along with the prices. And the theme of the month is called Whimsy. Um, and the variation number I got is number 32. Hopefully you can see that. Hold on. Well, it does not want to autofocus. Okay, there we go. Oh, I, I forgot to mention that my box actually weighed 1.8 pounds. I don't know why I forgot. And I'm always aggravated at, I, I try not to be aggravated. When I watch a video of people unboxing their boxes, I'm always like, what is the, what is the weight of your box? And most people tend to say, oh, I don't know what the weight of the box is. I don't know where to find it. And I'm like, well, you've been doing these unboxings for quite a while. You should know. Um, but also some of them tend to forget to uh, say the weight of the box. And it's like, I keep watching to make sure I didn't miss it. And when I go to, not just me, but when others go to say, hey, what's the weight of your box? Nobody comments. And that tends to upset people a little bit, um, myself included. I, I mean, I don't get that mad. I just be like, I wanna know because I'm hoping to get that box. But I'm kind of upset with myself that I didn't include that in the beginning of the video. But I'm glad I did. Now, in this box, I did receive six products. I'm just going to go ahead and pull the product that I received out. The first product I have here is the Cat Von D Cake Pencil Liner. Oh, yeah. The price of this is $19. I love almost all of Kat Von D's products. I, I really do like them. And anytime I receive a Kat Von D product or item, you know, I like to keep it <laughs> because it's something that I enjoy having because let's just say they're really good. They're really, really good. And they perform very well. Um, it says here that, uh, if I can read, un- Presidented creaminess, intensely rich color, and fudge proof or fudge resistant, waterproof long wear in a 100% vegan eyeliner. Now you can, or now you don't have to choose between luxurious, creamy comfort, comfort, and true performance. I'm sorry, this, this video is actually my second take. I tried to do my first take, which it came out wonderful. And then I was so mad. I was like looking through the video. And I saw myself and I had like a smudge of makeup like hanging down on my skin the entire video that I made. And it was just right there. And I was like, oh my gosh, somebody's going to point that out and they're going to say, you need to wipe that off. That's kind of messy. <laughs> but I tend to pick point on those things. So anyway, moving on. Here is what the packaging looks like. Here's what it looks like here. It was a lot sharper earlier, so you do need to put on a light coat. You don't have to put on a thick coat. If you put on a thick coat, 
it will smudge. In the first video I made, I did a swatch and I did a really thick swatch and I went to go wipe it and it smudged. And I was like, oh my god, I just ruined it for everybody. I ruined the fact it was smudge proof. And that wasn't such a good thing. So then I did a lighter swatch and what happened was is it didn't smudge. Because when I put it and I applied it underneath my waterline, underneath the top part of the lashes, it did not move whatsoever. It stayed put and I'm really happy about that. And I'm happy because it didn't go to the bottom part of the line, to the bottom part of the waterline on the bottom part of the eye. So I was really happy about that. So I'm going to go ahead and do a little swatch. The thing about this though is I want to I want to wait to do a um a smudge proof test. That way it dries completely. Now it does dry pretty quickly, but I want to make sure that I give it quite enough time. The second product in here. Now this product here, I'm not sure how to put this. Okay, I spoiler alert on my uh, boxy looks. I'm sorry, on my boxy looks. Um, I received uh, an item that was the same, the same product in each box. And don't quote me on this, but I'm sure. Well, you can, you can let me know if I'm not right. I don't know if I was thinking it's what they said. <laughs> I'm not sure, but. Yosef mentioned that if you get more than one box, you should not receive the same product in the other box that you get for the same month, basically. And I ended up getting a repeat, uh, the same item in a second box that I, re I received for the month of December. So I wasn't. I wasn't too happy. I mean, I'm really excited. This is a really nice product here. This is beautiful. And I love highlighters. I don't know if you've been watching my videos, but highlighters are my main fave. They're like heaven to me. They, I love a nice, beautiful glow. Well, I, I go all out sometimes <laughs> on my glow. But receiving the second item put me at like, oh my goodness. Uh, I need to let them know that I ended up getting a repeat or another of this, basically the same item in my other box. And I did, I did reach out to them, um, to let them know, to inform them that there was a mistake or that something happened, but I have been waiting about five hours and I still have not received an email back. I told them that I do need to do an unboxing for all of you, but I don't want to be negative because BoxyCharm is such an amazing subscription. I didn't want to be negative or I didn't want to put negative publicity out there at all. I didn't want to cause a stir basically. Um, but I did, I did want to warn you all in, or basically get you to take a second look into your boxes um, or prepare you that you may get a repeat by accident. I know I don't know if it's by accident or if that's what they meant to put in there. But if you do, go ahead, let Boxy Charm know um, that you got uh, the same thing. And if so, I'm sure that once they see more of us letting them know, they will figure out that something happened. And we should be able to get this resolved. So, I don't want to be a Debbie Downer, basically. But I want I want you all to... I basically, I just want to prepare you, like I said. Be ready in case you do get a repeat. But let me know, like I said. Put in the comment down below if I'm right. If that's what Yosef... Or how do I say his name? Yosef, if that's what he said. Because I would like to know uh, in case I made a mistake and sent them an email. And I don't want to feel bad about it. So this highlighter here is the Ciate uh, Confetti Highlighter. Achieve a Sun Kiss Glow with Ciate London's Confetti Highlighter. 
featuring a mix of shades that have been carefully pressed together for a radiant highlight in one sweep. The price for this is $32. $32. Now, I will prepare you. Uh, this packaging looks like a mirror. And it's you get, you get like fingerprints all over it. But here is what the product looks like. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look at that. I will tell you that I am, yes, a highlighter fanatic. Oh, yeah. I have a ton of highlighters that I keep. I don't ever give them away. Some of them I do. Some of them, some of them, yes, I do. But I, I'm a junkie. I'm a highlighter junkie. I'm addicted to highlighters. I love that serious glow. Uh, sometimes I go bold. I go bright. I go blinding. And then sometimes I go subtle. I just love the way it looks on my skin. So, but other than that, you guys are going to be excited. This is going to go in a giveaway drawer or the giveaway drawer that's beside me. Um, the other one I received, uh, if I get this in there, the other one I received will be going to a friend of mine for the holidays. And yes, I'm really, I'm really jealous of this highlighter. I really wanted to swatch it for all of you, but we will be getting more highlighters. And I do know I will be getting some highlighters for Christmas, which is funny because that's mostly what I ask for sometimes. So. But other than that, uh, I want to be generous. So I'm like, okay, this is going to go in the giveaway drawer. So that way, when I do have a giveaway, somebody will win this lucky, beautiful highlighter. All right. So there that is. It's in the drawer. The third product that I have here is... Prepare yourself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is, and I'm telling you, I was so freaking excited for this palette. I got the Natasha Denona <laughs> Cranberry Palette. Whoa. When I saw this in the spoilers, I was like, I want to get that so bad. So I do not have any uh, Natasha Denona eyeshadow palettes. I do have... The highlighter and blush uh, palette I got last month from my premium. And that was amazing. So, I was excited. And I love it. And I am using it. Alright, it says here that these buttery soft shades blend seamless, seamlessly in order to create a vibrant, ultra pigmented, long-lasting look. And the price for this. Oh, buddy. $48. Yeah, and it lives up to the price. I'm telling you, it does. Here are the beautiful colors in this palette. My oh my. Now I gotta look in the mirror real quick and make sure I don't got a smudge hanging down my face. <laughs> I'm just checking. Yeah, I'm checking my lips too, so... <laughs> The color I have on my lips is sitting there, and I'm like, please don't rub off. All right, so I am actually, let's check on that swatch, that Kat Von D eyeliner swatch. Let's go ahead and bam. Look at that. Can you see that? I'm rubbing on it, <laughs> and it is not coming off. This is a great swatch, <laughs> so that way I'm not ruining it for you guys. This this is an amazing, an amazing eyeliner. I'm going to go ahead and wipe it off so I can do the eyeshadow swatch for all of you. Okay. And I will say this. There is a shade in here that I, I am just shook by. It is my favorite now, and it's like the my most favorite shade in here. All right, 
So I'm making sure that I'm recording. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to give you the names of these swatches, okay? This first one is my favorite. The one I was talking about that I actually fell in love with. This is called Daisy. Now, this shimmer shade here is pink with an aqua kind of purplish, aqualish kind of blue color. I don't know if that made sense. It's kind of like got a hint of little frost blue color along with a bit of a purple, a light purplish lavender color. And then it's got your Barbie pink color and the shimmers just make it look like, how do you put it? The shimmers have more of a, um, holographic shimmers into it and it just looks beautiful it's like a pinkish aqua oh, I just don't know how to say it it's just it's a barbie pink basically but with a nice subtle uh hue of blues and purples like not a lot of purples but more like it's got I don't know. I'm just not going to continue to blab on because you're probably like, just continue. I just want to share the color with you. It's just beautiful. You have to be here in person or have to see it in person to get what I'm trying to tell you. This is just a pink that you will fall in love with. And I don't, I'm not a pink kind of person. And this pink is more like a bubble gum frosty blue and lavenderish kind of purplish pink it's beautiful you have like i said you have to see it in person to know what i'm talking about so there's that the second shade here that i have is called sakura the third shade is called botanic which is right here this shade here is called blossom which is right here and then this one is called um nude Right, so one of them, um, lo it looks kind of uh, patchy, but honestly, it's not. It's because I put way too much of the swatch on. The third product in here is the Glow Recipe uh, Watermelon Pink Juice Moisturizer. This is was exciting. 90% of this silky glow moisturizer is spiked with vitamin and amino acid rich watermelon extract, plumping hyaluronic acid and soothing botanicals like peony and jasmine extracts. This cooling gel emulsion absorbs instantly to seal in hydration and prep the skin for the day ahead. Antioxidants guard against free radicals and repair damaged cells along the way. Use morning and night. It drenches skin in luxurious, long-lasting moisture. And the retail value for this, $39. $39. My goodness. And it actually, even though it says that this is for um, oily to combo skin, I was actually watching um, Hot Mess Mama. I don't know if you all watch her, but let me know down in the comment section down below. Um, she's an amazing, I love her, I love her channel. I love her vlogs, I watch them. I, I feel like a, kind of a stalker in some way, like, cause I watch them and basically that's what they're there for, you to watch and enjoy her everyday life on the vlogs. Anyway, I also watch her uh, makeup channel which is amazing, by the way. She did say that she has dry skin and it's, it's, okay. She has dry skin and she says that this works amazingly and she loves it. She loves it. So if this works for her skin, my skin is dry too. It's like 
really dry. And I was thinking this might not be for my skin. But when I watched the video and she said that this stuff is amazing, I'm like, okay, I'll keep this and I'll try it and I'll give it a use. And I will tell you the first video I did do, I did swatch it and it, it's amazing. I, I have to rave about it. It's, it's, oh my God, I'm like rambling on. Kyla, just get to the point. Anyways, it's not just for oily skin or combo skin. It is also for dry, mature skin. So hopefully you all heard that. So I have to tell you, I actually love this packaging. It's a great idea that they put this in a glass bottle that keeps it from having parabens and stuff, like something to do with the plastic. Um, plastics aren't always that good for your skin with the products that are inside a plastic bottle, but I'm not going to go on and on about that. But like I said, this is an amazing and amazing packaging. Um, I also like the fact to watch this. It comes in a pump. And that's amazing too. So <laughs> I love having a pump. So we're going to go ahead. Like I said, I've already used it once before. It smells amazing, by the way. It smells like candy, like candy watermelon. Or watermelon candy, basically. I'm like not making sense whatsoever. But I do apologize on my hand. Um, the weather has been pretty rough. And washing and cooking and cleaning for the winter. Or I'm not sure it's winter quite yet. It's still fall. But it's been irritated and I ended up scratching my hand. So I do apologize for you all seeing that. Um, so we're going to go ahead. It smells so good. You can smell the watermelon that is in this. Oh, yeah. All right. All right, so for the next product that we have here is... This is exciting because I forgot to mention that you do get a chance to choose a product for the following month. Um, that is coming up that you want to receive in your box. So I'm sorry I did not mention that. Last month I got a choice between this and uh, a dermatitis um, cream or a, a cream that is for dermatitis on your face or some kind of skin issue that people tend to have and need to heal it or need a cream for that. Um, I'm sorry if I'm not making sense, but I, I really don't have that issue at the moment, so I didn't need it. I love having anything that is for the lips. And this is a nighttime lip mask. Let's see. Sorry. I feel like I got a hair in my eye. Let's see. This is called the, um, where are we at? Bite Beauty Agave Plus Nighttime Lip Therapy. A deeply hydrating overnight lip mask and a game-changing balm to oil formula for more nourished and supple lips overnight. This lip therapy is clean, vegan, cruelty-free, and gluten-free, infused with our chamomile bergamot dream scent. The price for this is $22. This is a really, really big size, and I have to mention to you, for $22, that's quite quite a uh, good amount for this price. And I believe, I know, this is going to last me quite a long, long, long time. So a little goes a long way. Remember that. This lid is like an anti-slip lid. So I don't think you're going to have an issue opening it. Here's what it looks like. You do get a spatula, which I love that. It keeps your product clean. It keeps you from putting germs inside that product when you put your finger in there. There is what that looks like. There is the bomb. Oh my gosh. Yes, you can smell the bergamot. Like, it smells really good. Now, you will get confused thinking it smells like um, 
orange creamsicle, which yes, it does smell like that, but that's the bergamot that you're smelling. So I just figured I'd put that out there. So for the last product, which I'm really excited about. Okay. Do you remember me saying that I watch Hot Mess Mama? Oh, yeah. She had a look on her face <laughs> when she opened her box. And I was, like, psyched about it. Like, she got me all, like, off of my chair thinking, oh, my gosh, that's awesome. What I'm going to tell you is this product right here that had her shook off the core that she was excited about. This is the Avant Deluxe Hyaluronic Acid Vivifying Face and Eye Night Cream. The price that shook her to the core and that shakes me to the core for this size or for this product. $134. Yeah. So. What do you think? Yeah, for over $100 for this product. This better be like some really good stuff. Like really, really outstanding, amazing stuff for your skin. It says here that Deluxe Hyaluronic Acid Vivifying Face and Eye Night Cream is a delightful anti-aging moisturizer for face and targeted eye area. Formulated with hyaluronic acid to deeply nourish your skin, it also combines signature ingredients to improve the appearance, the appearance of large pores, uneven skin tone, fine lines, and dullness, and a weakened skin surface. The price... Oh, oh my gosh. Why am I telling you? I already told you the price. <laughs> Yeah. All right. I'll show you up close. The size of this bottle is only 1.69 fluid ounce. Yeah. So, oh, I almost broke it. Oh my God. Be nice, Kyla. Be nice to this product. All right. As small as this is, this I understand that this might be the right size because it's just a night cream. You don't use it during a day. So this is an appropriate amount, I believe. But here it is up close. And I have to tell you too, the smell of this is delightful. It's not like delightful as in candy delightful. It's delightful as in it smells beautiful. Look at that color. It's blue. It rubs in. It's not too thick. And you can tell that there is hyaluronic acid in there. Because it's like water. Hey, Roxy, come here. Come here. Sorry about that. But wow. You can smell cucumber. A little bit of rose. And there is another hint of a floral scent. That I cannot name. Yeah. I don't know what it is. And it smells beautiful. It smells beautiful. So it says on the back. I did read the back. But the only thing I'm seeing that it says that it added a fragrance. And that there is something called sea water. So if that's what's making that really nice smell. Along with that fragrance. It's beautiful. This could be like a perfume. But it's not too strong to put on your face is what I'm saying. So I will be uh, using this. All right. I'm like, I'm happy. I actually got to show you all what I received. <sighs> Anyways, this box, this month has blown my mind to bits. Like literally blown my mind. It has rocked my world and I'm pretty happy. Except for the fact that I received a repeat or an extra, an item that, the same item that I received in my Boxy Lux. But that, that'll be dealt with. I'm sure it'll get resolved. So, no worries. Other than that, that is actually all that is in my box. 
So now, hoping that my makeup is still doing well, I'm putting a lippy to the test at the moment. So I've been looking inside the mirror to check to see how it's going. And I apologize about that. <laughs> but I'm also trying to make sure I don't got any kind of makeup going everywhere. All right. So I want to go ahead and say thank you so much <laughs> for being patient and watching me unbox my BoxyCharm Premium box for the month of December. If you can, hoping if you can, go ahead and like this video. If you want to, but you do not have to, subscribe. And once you subscribe, go ahead, hit that notification bell that's down below. That way you get notified of my next video. Well, we're at the end. I'm going to go ahead and say bye to all of you. I love you. I love every single one of you. And I cannot wait to see you next time. Love you. Bye.